Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Pew, pew, pew. First and foremost, I just want to say thank you so much for 380 subscribers. Thank you guys, I love you and I see the support. Yo, your girl loves you. Real talk. <laughs> So today's video is actually going to be about the things I love about Germans or living in Germany. Okay. This is really coming from my heart, yo. Um, you are a liar. Don't think I'm trying to be sarcastic or anything because people are always saying bad stuff about Germany, living in German. Stuff like that. But today I'm going to be like looking on the positive side and telling you guys what I really like about living in Germany to inspire anybody who's coming or moving to Germany. Yeah? So let's get right into it. Why am I always like dancing to some music in my head? <laughs> if you're new to my channel, hi. My name is Michelle, as my channel name already says, Life with Michelle. If you want to get to know me, please go click on the videos before and know who I am, what I'm all about. So that some of the things that I'll say will make sense to you or not. This is just a way to make you click back and view my profile and my channel. <laughs> I hope it works. So, the first thing that I really, really, really like about Germans, not really, but like, I like it, is that they are blip honest they're very honest you guys and that is why germans are one of uh, some of like the most reliable people <laughs> i'm not caping honestly they are so honest they'll let you know if you've offended them they'll let you know if you they like you they will let you know if they'll let you know just just know that you won't have to wonder what a german is thinking about you because they will let you know and also on the un honest part uh, there are so many like little small musikas here also in germany which sell like strawberries and stuff like that and sometimes the person selling does not even need to sit at the stand they just put their fruits or like whatever they're selling they write the price and people come and get the stuff and put the money like you guys I I can't know, but no, I'm so good. So on the person gonna This is probably also the reason why the trains or the public transport in Germany, except for buses, yeah, do not require you to show a ticket before entering. Like you literally buy a ticket and you get in. And they trust the people so much because they know they're honest enough to buy a ticket before getting in. And yeah, sometimes they use the police to control if you have a ticket or not. But like, just that sort of trust and honesty in, 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 in a country as a whole, I just have to like applaud that. Honesty. The second thing I really like about Germans is that they are hardworking. Germans are very, very, very much hard workers in the sense of they literally leave to go to work <laughs> you know what i'm saying like the jobs here are quite paying like they're really good paying as compared to like i'm not going to compare to anything but for you to get that money you would have really worked you know it's just like a one day and you're like you know flexing and stuff like that work is really taken as something serious here so much so that um I don't know how to explain it. But they're just hard workers, know that. They work hard. Very hard. Like, a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on. Here in Germany, when somebody asks you how you are doing, they really want to know how you are doing. And I think that's so beautiful. Because most of the times, the way I come from, when people say, and they must say, even if you have had a terrible day, 
they don't care they just want you to hear you say yeah and if you already start saying like no and is a boy because of this you're like saying it's okay okay tmi you know what i'm saying so when i came here i'd just be like to people hello wie geht's hello guten tag wie geht's us in but i would really not be meaning it like how are you doing i just want to hear like make it's good danke you know but the people are quite different they will tell you all the details of their lives why they're not okay even if it was a bot that they fell worse taking a sh you will be told and this is the same kind of concern that they have most of the time when they ask you oh if there are any germans watching my video correct me if i'm wrong do you guys really mean it when you ask how are you or do you not because most of the times i've had people ask me how are you and i'm like i'm okay and then they're like really are you okay and i'm like oh, you care <laughs> another thing i like about germans is they do not like living complicated lives right um if they they don't how can i say it? they don't care specifically about what they wear for example right the clothes do not have to be flashy or anything they have to serve a purpose so you're going to see somebody wearing socks with sandals and a jacket and a hat and a skirt and underneath their trousers why because it's cold so they want the trousers but it's also like i don't know going to church so they want to wear a skirt or like the skirt is really nice they want to wear it first time i came here i was like what in the heck is going on here like you'd see people wearing sandals and socks and i'm like who wears sandals and socks and they're like yeah you need the socks because it's a bit cold but the sandals are really chic so in one word germans are very practice and i love that i don't love like complicated stuff i don't like like not having a reason why i'm doing something and they always have a reason why they're doing what they're doing so i think that's beautiful another thing that kind of honestly baffles me but also makes me admire germans more is how almost everyone knows everything about everything i'm talking if you're sitting in a group right now and any topic comes up like i don't know clouds everybody knows information about it i don't know if you guys are like walking googles or computers or the size of your apartment everybody knows like to the exact square meter like i would get asked by my schoolmates or stuff also oh, how many square meters is your is your apartment and i'm like there's a room <laughs> like in the bed that's all that matters but if you ask any german so how many square meters is your apartment they know like really to the last point and i'm like you're so smart smart or i'm just dumb dumb they really take interest in a wide range of topics. I still haven't found out how they do it, but even my boyfriend, you can start any topic with him like, "Oh, let's talk about Steve Williams." I don't know who the heck that is or if that person even exists, but I'm just saying it as an example to show you how. And he was like, "Yeah, the guy who was born in oh, I think that the and I'm just like sitting there like, "Hey." Eh? <laughs> so the first time I actually had dinner with my boyfriend's family i was just like yeah <laughs> i think i'm gonna head out because <laughs> i was the only one not contributing to the conversation because i was like how on earth am i expected to know all this it doesn't concern me and you know it's not something that i need in my everyday life why would i take interest in knowing stuff another thing i love about germans yo and i know so many people are going to disagree but this is my opinion i think germans are very funny and you know what's funny about it is because they do not realize that they are most of most of the times many germans are like so serious so you're not so sure if this is nancy costly or like <laughs> i always find it so funny because it leaves me confused but when you say something sarcastic back to them they're like huh? he minds do does <laughs> and i'm like dude you started the sarcasm thing i'm just playing along you know you're not getting it how 
honestly if you think germans are not funny you just haven't unlocked their level of thinking yet i still also haven't but i find it funny because <sighs> just come to germany and find another them. thing i love about germans is that if they like you they will make you some food <laughs> you know me our food is like <laughs> No, honestly, if they like you, they will really find a way of expressing it. And it's usually with making food. Like, I'm not so sure what Germans do for fun. Apart from, like, um, inviting each other to meals and and going for walks. And, like, also, like, going to cinemas and the normal stuff. But, like, I'm talking of, they're not really, like, the party type of people. Like, you know, music, dancing, shaking our bars off, like, where I come from. So... They express their love through giving you food. So if they like you, they're gonna make you a Kesselkuchen. If they like you, they're going to bake you something. They're going to, you know, and I just love that because I just love being liked. I love the food and I also love the people who like loving me to love giving me food. <laughs> By the way, we are not starving in Africa. So don't be like, yeah, this is the evidence that, you know, people in Africa are starving. We have good food in Africa. I just thought I should address that quickly. You on the topic food, another thing I love about Germans is how they make their food with all their hearts. Like, they will explain to you to the last level how they made their asparagus. I'm talking about asparagus because right now we're in the asparagus season and... who I've been getting so many recipes. They're like, yeah... <clears throat> Also Michelle, wie machst du dein Spargel? And I'm just like, mm, I don't know, boiled, gebraten. And they're like, ich habe so ein gutes, uh, what is it called? Recipe, Rezept? <laughs> I forgot the word. For dish. Also du nimmst das Spargel, ein bisschen Olivenöl, ein bisschen Black Pepper und so. And you're like explaining it and you're and I'm, and I'm already salivating like the passion they have for the food that they make. I love it. Another thing, this one I don't really love it, but I just admire it about Germans is their zeal and their ability to follow rules. Like, I've never seen any country that falls, follows the rules like German. But I haven't been to many countries, so, like, pff, what am I even saying? But pff, the rules here are made to be followed, and people do follow them. Like, I'm talking, if they write a rule here that, like, you're supposed to walk in a straight line here, but you're going to see people walking in a straight line. doesn't matter if the room extends or not. They're going to do it. And I just think that's beautiful. I think, like, yeah, I don't know how, how the crime rate in Germany is, but... I'm presuming is kind of low. <laughs> I don't know. She's mich tot. But yeah, in that aspect, I just want to like applaud you as a country. I don't know how you instill that in people so much so that it fo it's followed for generations. I don't know if it started with Hitler and the Nazis. Oof. I don't want to talk about that. Let me just leave it at I like how Germans follow rules. I also love the infrastructure in Germany and I'm, to I'm not talking about the houses. Per se, I'm talking about the roads. Like the cities and the roads are really nice and clean, y'all. Like you can literally eat off the street. No, you can't. But I'm just saying it's so you you feel it that I'm in a you know I'm in a mid One last thing. Of course there are a lot of things I like about Germany and Germans, but I could spend the whole day. <laughs> I wouldn't. A <laughs> little bit of shade, a little bit of please. A little bit shady, please. <laughs> but the other thing I really like or I find cute is that they are obsessed with the sun and like sunlight, sunshine. Because here it's not every day that you get good sunshine. So every time there's just a little bit of sunshine, you see everybody going out and getting ice cream. <laughs> And I'm like, oh dear, if y'all lived where I came from, you'd be outside all day, every day. <laughs> but I think it's cute. So if you see like the sun out, you're definitely going to know that the streets are going to be packed with people going out, buying ice cream, enjoying the sun and stuff like that. And I just think that's beautiful that they appreciate it so much. Back at home, I didn't really 
appreciate sunny days but now here knowing that you could have an entire week just full of snow or just rain and no dull when it when there's just a bit of sun i i don't go out but i appreciate it you, you know? can see there are so many things you love about germany if you still haven't made the decision of where you want to study <laughs> they should make me an ambassador like yeah i'm trying to bring people representing <laughs> yeah if you haven't made up your decision of where you want to study where you want to spend the rest of your life germany is definitely the country to come to but there's so many things to love about living in germany and this is just like my top 10 was it 10 things or nine i don't know my top 10 list of the things i love about living in germany and i really hope i managed to shade a bit of inside and the life in germany and stuff like that and if you enjoyed don't forget to click the subscription button be notified and just join me on this journey with life with michelle all you want to know about living in germany all you want to know about the life here before you actually make the decision of coming here and stuff like that i i would really love to show that to you so that you can decide before coming other than come and then decide otherwise definitely you love it here if you like like any of the things that i listed i'm also going to make a video of the things i really don't really necessarily like about german to balance the odds so you can wait out for yourself mm, am i going to be able to live there or not is it too much of uh, of cons or pros you know stuff like that and until then you guys don't forget to give this video a thumbs up i love you so much Bye. I was before I met you, yes, been